Hey guys, I don't really know if I've vlogged at all today. I don't think I have, and I apologize. It's like 8 p.m. at night, and I had my last voice lesson today for break, and that's kind of like bittersweet because now I don't have to like do anything. I have no plans for the rest of my time here at home. But today at break, or not at break, at voice, it was it was a really good lesson. Um. I just, I think we progressed a lot with my voice and my technique, and I think I've taken some really solid things with me that I can put into all of my practicing. What is this hair? Um, and also, I think I found some connections for speech pathology, which is a really cool, so I can take that with me as I apply to master programs and maybe I get into a master's program for job recommendations or anything because I know him now, uh, my voice teacher. And I don't know, that's really cool to hear that he he knows people in that industry. He didn't think I was absolutely crazy for being a voice major who wants to get their master's in uh, speech path. Um because I, I know it's done, but it, you know, it's reassuring to kind of hear that it's, it's fairly normal. It's not like completely unheard of. So that is good. And, and I was right in kind of my assumptions. I think, um, in his teaching, he, he spoke with a lot, a lot of physicality of the body and stuff. And I was like, I think, I think he has some knowledge of some speech pathology and he TA'd for somebody who is like huge in speech path. So that was really cool to hear and to know now um yeah I think I just I got some really good advice that I can just kind of take with me forward in my life as I continue singing and stuff so I am wearing now I gotta show this right gotta do my little arm stretch I'm wearing this little polka dot sweater I was wearing some skinny jeans but now I'm wearing pajama shorts because it's later at night <laughs> um yeah, I think if I can get it to work, I'm going to try and get some of my voice memo from the class and insert it into this vlog to listen to because I just take audio to listen to for myself. So, uh, yeah, there's like some stuff in there that I was pretty, pretty proud of. I think I haven't listened to it yet, so you never know. My opinion might change, but yeah, I had a lot of fun and uh, I don't know. Oh, and I got some errands done today. I went to the bank, finally, and deposited my check that I needed to deposit. And I went to the grocery store for my mom and bought some groceries for dinner and meatloaf and potato casserole. We call it bowling alley potatoes. I know my friend calls them f funeral potatoes. Anyways, I don't know. I bought a salad from our local grocer that I really love. It's like a pre-made, it's a chicken club salad and I love it. It's so yummy and it's like, I don't know, I sometimes I hate talking about calories but it's only 190 calories but it's huge and then, you know, I had my ranch on it so it's more but I love it. Uh, pretty tasty so I was like really excited about that. Um, I am going to try not to gross you guys out, but I am wearing that new mascara and let me get kind of like, need more light. I don't know if that helps at all. I like the way they look, but it's fiber lashes and like I knew there's going to be fibers in it because it's like a two coat system. So there's like a tube of mascara and a tube of fibers and I thought it was going to be more similar to like a mascara primer that had some fibers in it but it's like you pull out the wand and it's like dusty it's like dry it's dry fibers it's not even wet at all and you put it on your lashes and then you coat it with mascara I don't know but like my eyes were on fire for the first 30 minutes that I had it on and I was like uh I don't know and off and on my eyes kind of start to bother me because of the fibers, but 
I have no definite opinions on it, but I kind of feel like since it was $12, I might as well try to work with it a little bit and figure out how I feel about it. So, I will keep using it, and I guess I will update you on it, I'm sure. Um, but that is kind of what is going on today. Today was, like, not the most interesting day. Because once I got home from my lesson, it was like 2.30, and then I ate like five pizza rolls, and then I went to the store for my mom. And then I came back, and we had dinner at 6.30. And then I've just been kind of talking with my mom, like I do. Uh, we were talking about when I'm going to go back to Colorado, because I kind of had a plan for when I was going, and now... We don't know if that plan is still intact just because of the weather. Um, it looks like it's going to kind of snow. So, you want to be safe. You got to be safe. So, that's kind of like our goal right now is that I'm safe. Don't want to be driving in the snow. And I'm also just kind of feeling like, oh, I just want to spend time with my family. So, 